and welcome back to another FIFA 20 video and today I'm gonna review Internazionale it's going to be a very special video for all those Inter fans out there and before continuing please make sure to leave a like and subscribe to my channel because it will really help me grow uh, so uh, let's go uh, now I'm gonna try to make uh, this Inter team play exactly as they do in real life because uh, that's a 3-5-2 formation that they use uh, is gonna work perfectly in FIFA. I'm gonna modify it a bit uh, in, a, in a, the FIFA way. It's going to be a 3-5-2 uh, with a cam and uh, the, the, the main part of this formation is going to be these four midfielders who are gonna do all of the dirty work, uh, let's say, they're gonna try to defend and attack at the same time. So let's continue, we're gonna start in goal, is going to be Andanovic, the best goalkeeper in Serie A. Going up to the mid, uh, to the defender, sorry, is going to be uh, Godin in the center, and uh, we're gonna uh, play uh, De Vrij, uh at uh, the left side, and then we're gonna go with Skriniar at the right side. The best three center backs at uh, Inter, uh, it's difficult to go with another formation with this team, to be honest. And uh, moving up to the midfielders is going to be Barella and Brozovic. Uh, now this. Uh Two players gonna bring so much to your team and uh, they just are the best two all-around midfielders that we have we're gonna uh, sub out Sensi to bring in Sanchez I love Sensi in FIFA he's not that good and we're gonna put in Sanchez such an amazing player so elegant and uh, he's gonna bring so much for you uh, going up to the uh, to the right mid um, I love uh, Kandreva, but uh, I have to play Politano here. If we compare them uh, together, Politano has just a better stats in game. Uh, Kandreva can bring you more like the defending stats, but uh, we're gonna have Kandreva as an option for after minute 70, 75. Uh, moving up, uh, moving up to to our left side uh, is going to be uh, Asamoa. Uh, no doubt uh, the best option that uh, we can play here in this Inter team uh, not much in that left side to be honest and going up at the striking position is going to be uh, Martinez and uh, Lukaku now these absolute two tanks uh, are gonna score so much goals for you and alongside with uh, Sanchez uh, they're gonna bring uh, so much uh, to the game now uh, going up uh, to the tactics uh, is going to be a drop back and uh, with with be five and uh, deep with B3. Uh, now, uh, this uh, drop back uh, tactic uh, at the defense is gonna make Inter play uh, so much, uh, so better uh, with uh, this uh, 3 5 2. And moving up to the offense is going to be balanced with, uh, with 5, and the uh, players in the box uh, are going to be. Uh, Four, three, uh, you can decide, but I'm gonna leave it at four with corners and two and free kicks at two. And uh, going up at the player instructions is going to be getting behind and stay forward uh, for your cam and two strikers. Now, these three players are gonna cause the damage to your opponent's team, but they just have to stay forward and the others have to sacrifice for them. So, moving up to the to the midfielders is going to be a comeback in defense and uh, uh, getting behind uh, for uh, your left mid and right mid and at the same time uh, we're gonna uh, we're gonna add uh, the option so they can stay wide we just need them at the at the that wing so they can dominate the, the wing play moving up to the Moving up to our center mid, it's going to be a cut past in lane, stay back while attacking and cover center on both of them. We just want them uh, to be there whenever we can get a uh, counter. Do not touch your uh, center back, just leave them at default. So I'm gonna go into a game now and I'm gonna try this team out. So let's go.